of this year's championship. Moving to number 10, Stephen Hendry's incredibly wild shot under pressure on the Brown from the tight cushion when his opponent was one frame away from victory. 40. And that's why he's the number one in the world. Wonderful shot. Number nine. John Higgins making crazy doubler and landing perfectly on the black for making a 147 points break. No doubt about that. He's going to play the double or he's going to play it into the corner. He's going to play it. Perfect on the black. Number eight, Sean O'Sullivan makes a stunning thin cut shot on the black for a 147 max break. Number seven, Jones shocks everyone in the arena by achieving a triumphant shot on the black, which was do or die. This would be some shot. This would be some shot. What a shot that was. Word, you won't see a better pressure shot than that. Had the black not gone in, he needed two supers. Well, what a pot to keep yourself in the match. Incredible. Number six, Mark J. Williams' unbelievable cannon shot that leaves everyone surprised and confused. Take the commentators. I'll take it though. Um, what means John Higgins needs snookers now? There was no raised hand, but I don't think he played this. But eventually they accepted that he really went for that. You know, Joe, I really do think he did. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I think he did play it. I didn't think so at first, but. Certainly do now. Number five, Ronnie O'Sullivan's crazy cannon shot from no angle. He brings the best of him to put loads of side with a precision. He's trying to avoid that shot. And for number four, that is one of the best positional shots I've ever seen.